Ah, greetings, Mr. Monty Ives. How did you know my name? <laughs> Fair enough. I'm on the brink of being hired as a television show writer, and I need absolute concentration to make my work as good as it can possibly be. I, I can't afford loud neighbors costing me this job. This is the third apartment I've looked at in as many weeks. How unfortunate for you. One can only hope that the answer to all of your problems may lie here at Fallen Crest. Allow me to take your bags. You could lower the volume on your stereo just a bit. <laughs> I look below you. I've got some very important writing to get done. <laughs> Airplugs, man, they work wonders, right, bro? But you see, I shouldn't have to wear earplugs. Please, just as a courtesy for a few nights, so I can get my work done. Let's check with the council, hey, Troy. Troy, hey, this guy, this guy wants us to turn down the music for a few days, so so he can write some shit. What do you say? Oh. <laughs> Lisa, 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 what do you have to say about all this? Oh, it looks like the council is all spoken. Sorry, buddy, no deal. Please fuck off the premises. Peace. Troublesome neighbors? Here lies the answer to all of your woes. Push this button in times of distress. It is your solution to use as you please, but be warned. A tenth use of its capabilities is one too many and will result in undesirable consequences.
Mr. Ives. What's going on? Young kids. So flighty in their youth. It seems they just up and disappeared, leaving their earthly possessions behind. It's not too uncommon around here. We have a high turnover rate. You'll get a new neighbor by tonight. Monty Ives. I'm your downstairs neighbor. And I'm a registered sex offender.
the life up there, damn it! Can a guy get some peace and quiet around here? I thought you said this place was quiet. I assure you, you will not be disappointed with our accommodations. Allow me to take your bags. Kuba! Yeah. I'm in the house. Disturbance. Live life. <laughs> you are ready. Live life like you're gonna die. Because you're gonna. I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but you're gonna die. Maybe not today or even next year, but before you know it, you'll be saying, Is this all there was? What was all the fuss? Why did I bother? Now... Maybe you won't suffer, maybe it's quick, but you'll have time to think. Why did I waste it? Why didn't I taste it? You'll have time. Cause you're... gonna die. Yes, it's going to happen because it's happened to a lot of people I know. My mother, my father, my loves. Ah, uh, greetings, Mr. Monty Ives. How did you know my... How did you... How did you know my...